Well, hey folks, Species7 here. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Farm Sim 19. Got a map review for you here today, and this is the Old Family Farm 2019 version. Now, this is a map that I played quite a lot on back in 2015's version of the game, and, uh, had quite a good time. It was an awesome map to bring your small gear, your old gear, your, you know, slow stuff, and uh, tend a bunch of little fields. So let's have a look at what they've got. Obviously, it's going to have uh, changed somewhat. We'll have a look at the main map. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I'm going, what a weird map. <laughs> but here we are. And, all right, it looks uh, very similar to what it was. Okay, we got Animal Dealer, the Sawmill, the Dairy, the Rail Line. Then we got a whole bunch of stuff in behind that shop. Alrighty. And if we decide that we want to buy things, like, wow, that's a big section. 836k. <laughs> Alrighty, it buys you most of everything. Alright, now, I don't see a BGA. That's a little concerning. Alright, 315, that's a big chunk, 700. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well, just because we always do, yes please. There we are, but it's all ours now. So here you go. A good, decent bit of space here to drop down some sheds, throw down a silo. Of course, for the amount of money you just spent, you may want to uh, actually go out and check what's in your fields and see if you can afford to even rent a tractor. All right, let's have a look. As you see, very, very basic here. All right, we've got... Uh, this doesn't show as being any sort of a tip point or anything, so I'm thinking this is uh, basically storage. Uh, it almost looks like a water pump system. However, I'm not thinking it's uh, actually functional, is it? Let's have a look, shall we? Mm, no. Oh, actually. There's actually quite a bit. Sorry, uh, I'll try and stop saying actually. I don't know what's up with me today. There's quite a bit of hitbox there. This may well be water. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. And once more. Just to make sure it's actually off. Alright. So yeah, there's just a lot of open space here. So you can certainly... Uh, Start dropping down critters and all of that sort of thing. As there are none uh, readily available upon the map when you start. Alright, so here's one of your fields. This is field two. Yeah, you're not going to want to be bringing the, uh, you know, the biggest of the two Johnny Deers in here to harvest. And you certainly don't need a 400 horse tractor to take care of these sort of things. But that's a decent size field. So where's field one then? Oh, I see. We just did not go far enough. Now, can I go through here? I can. I'm happy. Oh, field one. All right. Decent enough. Decent enough. I'm just a little bit curious as to... Uh, and, of course, we do get a little bit of forest going on here. Whoop. <laughs> See, there used to be... Now, this is all different. This this wasn't on the original family farm. I think this is the border of the map, pretty much, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I was just mowing the meadow, and all of a sudden... All right. Oof. Look at this. So you could actually set up a little farm up here if you wanted to, and then just buy a, a field or two. Oh, really? We didn't get all those other fields for our $800,000? All we got was field... Oh, I see. Okay. Two and five, and then three and six over on the other side. Alrighty. So, the rest of our little empire does not lie in that direction. Hmm. 
Well, let's have a look at our last couple of buildings. What have we here? Are you a functional anything, anyone? Are you? Are you? I can't see what value you'd be. Let's have a look, you know. Uh, huh. Again, it has this... There is a giant hitbox, but... Huh. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Very interesting. And here we've got an equipment shed. All right. Now, this also showed a hitbox, and it is a working fuel tank. So that may well be a silo, although I don't really see where you would dump. You know? Um, I didn't miss, uh, maybe in here, did I? Let's have a quick look. No. No, not this time. Hmm, interesting. And then a slightly more modern looking shed here. Excellent. Alright, let's, uh... Let's carry on. We have... Again, you can see these are not by any means large fields. Hay and feed and town and the livestock markets that way. Well, all right of them. All right, field 11, one of the larger ones. Okay. And let's have a look at our facilities. Ooh-wee. All right. So the bay hay and feed, eh? All righty, let's have a look at the bay hay and feed. And they take, uh, bay hay and feed. Okay, this is the first one. Looks like they take everything. Um, what's with this second one here? Oh, all right. Potatoes and sugar beets only. Yep, okay. And it would appear that there, yeah, okay, there's markets for all of the products. So good. Eh, wool is kind of disappointing. For a single-player map, you really want it to be higher, otherwise it's almost not worth having sheeps. And why would you not want sheeps, right? Alright, there's no market for dung or manure. But everything else seems reasonable. Okay, not that there's a long way to go, I'm sure, between, uh, you know, point A and, let's say, you know, point B. But... Oh, yeah, here's your shop. Yeah, this is familiar. I mean, it is a little different, I think. Um, potatoes and sugar beets. Huh. Well, there's a big hitbox in front of it, so I guess you can off your potatoes and sugar beets there. All right, is this a lime station? Uh... She has no spoot. Alrighty. Now, is there, I don't remember, a lime station on here? Oh, yeah. There is definitely, well, maybe that is then. Maybe it, whoa. <laughs> maybe it's a spoutless lime station. Yep. It has a large box around it. So there you go. Hmm. <coughs> Nice to see a uh, gri uh, grill over at the, uh, and there's your grain tip there. Yeah, it would have really been nice to have seen some sort of a grill on the, uh, the tip point for the, whoa, I've <laughs> gone and swummed through the river. There should be, I remember right, there was some sort, of, yeah, here we go. See, there is an actual road if you come out of the, uh, the feed and seed, and you had to trundle through the river. Yeah. Farm fresh milk. Okay. And then he came upon this place. Oh, there didn't used to be people wandering around. There was, like, older shacks. 
In fact, it, <laughs> without being derogatory, because I know the expression does seem derogatory to some people, but it reminds me of like, you know, somewhere down, I don't know, Black Hills or something, with all these hillbillies living there. And, no, they still got that, the train that never comes. There used to be a sheep. This is where your sheep used to be. It was up through here. Now they've got something going on by the look of it. Wow. That goes back quite a ways. we got a little meadow here. Very nice. Okay. Oh. Interesting. This is actually a separate little farm. Whoop. Sorry. Yeah, it is too. Hmm. No real fields, but as you can see, it does contain this area. And it's only 400k. Right on. Gets you a decent shed. And lots of grass, eh? So if you want to start fairly reasonable. I, I, personally, I would probably start here. You know? And... That looks like an animal pen, doesn't it? But, as far as I know, it is actually not. Mm, no, there's no functional anythings there. It's just a place to look cool. Hmm. Yeah, this is probably where I'd start. You can make some darn good money from silage. Huh. Alright, so that's just another starting farm. Excellent. There's your uh, diesel tanks. So you can get your fuel. One left. Alright, now let's head back. Let's head back. Whoops. <laughs> We're gonna go around the puddle. It seems considerably bigger than it used to be. Um, yeah, which I'm not saying is a bad thing. Ah, look what we have stumbled upon. And this would be our sawmill. So here we go. Here's our saw point for the logs. Excellent. I think this, yeah, I did too. This used to be a pond. This used to be a log pond. They drained all the water and put a tip point in instead. Alrighty. Now, is the wood chip point o sale also functional? Alright. Yeah, it's got the markers. And it has. Oh. It has. Not got a hitbox. Hmm. Well, that's kind of unfortunate. And you can see the one way over there for the, uh, the logs. Well, that doesn't appear to be... Huh. There, 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 there. Alright, so that's... That's our lumber mill. Quite an extensive little setup, isn't it? Alright, we should have... Just here. Uh, this is the, uh, what the heck they call, uh, train yard or something? Rail line. Yeah, and as you can see, oh, they, they won't take oats. Oh. Apparently no one here will buy oats. Isn't that strange? Isn't that strange? I don't see that. Do we, we, we won't see that with anything else, will we? No? Looks like everything else is represented. Well, again, as I say, other than your uh, cow excrements. Interesting, no oats. Huh. Then, I guess, horses are out of the question on this one. Hmm. Now, there's some sort of a something going on over here, apparently. Ah, this is where we can sell our milk. <laughs> That's probably why there was a sign here, something about fresh milk. Oh, look, farm fresh milk. <laughs> there we go. That would be why. All right. 
Jeez, you know, we're uh, 15 minutes in, but I think we're pretty much... Where have we... Oops, where have we not... Uh, not had a little look yet. I think we've pretty much done her. Well, no, we didn't go and see the animal dealer, did we? Oh, well, let's go. At least I don't recall the animal dealer. Interesting. <coughs> anyway, let's uh, let's go and find ourselves. There it is. It wouldn't come back on. Let's go and find ourselves the animal dealer. He's right through here. He is. He is. There we are. There's the dirt road I cheated away from. Oh, across the river we go. Hey, look over here. <laughs> Are you fishing for boats? <laughs> Alright, so here we go. Buy them if you want them. Excellent. And then up this way. Oof. There's a violent bit of water. Don't know how it's getting there, but... Man, it's getting there with some sort of uh, intent. I'll give it that. All right, looks like we got a bit of a foresty sort of area. Let's have a little look here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We'll actually look down on the uh, the valley, and we can continue through here. And should you like to start your uh, Farm and experience by being a lumberjack as opposed to a farmer. Well, there you go. The other farm. And, uh, oh, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Yeah. You could uh, start your farm here. You get a couple of fields. You get a ton of forests for a mere 315k. There you go. And you get your, uh, farm all barn, you get some nice storage there, you get a house that's just scrappy enough, but, uh, oh, I don't own it, maybe it, well, let's find out, let's find out, just see if buying this will actually allow us to sleep, yes, please, we'll buy, thank you very much, all right, We've got half the map now. Eh, it doesn't bring anything up, does it? So, uh, I don't suppose this is the lawn chair you can sleep... Oh. Nope. Alright, well. Oh well. <laughs> you may not get a house to sleep in, but you get a, a decent bit of property, some fields, a well-used outhouse that is stocked to the rafters with toilet paper, and, of course... Uh, a fuel tank. And this one gets you 14, which is just down here. Oh, there's a helpful thing. You get a cotton field the size of a postage stamp that you need a machine the size of a barn to cut. <laughs> yeah, I don't know the cotton is practical. I think I would have rather seen them put oats in so you could at least feed a horse. Ooh, here's a steepy. Look at that. We got, like, contour and everything. Very nice. Well, that's a fair size field, actually. You'll get your dollars worth there, boy. And then, that's unfortunate, eh? They still got some of the old background stuff going on there. Not the, uh, not the prettiest of backdrops, but hey. And here you go. I believe this is one of the largest fields on the map. And you don't get it if you buy that piece of property. You have to buy it separately. Hmm. But there you are, guys. That is our look at Family Farm FS19 version. There will, of course, be a link in the description 
below as to where you could pick up this little gem all for yourself should you so desire hope you enjoyed if you did you know what to do hit the like button helps the channel out a whole bunch please please and uh, beyond that well take care of each other folks and ciao for now